Now, if you are going hungry on the 10 day green smoothie cleanse, then you are doing it wrong. Hello, I'm JJ Smith, author of the number one New York Times bestseller, 10 day green smoothie cleanse. I help people lose weight without dieting so they can get their sexy back, okay? Now, let me first say that the 10 day green smoothie cleanse is not a starvation diet. You don't need to starve yourself. You don't have to go hungry to get results. That's not what we're doing here. Every day, you should be eating a snack or drinking a green smoothie every few hours, two, three, four hours. This is to keep your metabolism revved up. Yes, you need to eat and eat often on this cleanse. And you don't just do all green smoothies every day. I mean, there's an option where you can eat salads, grilled chicken, grilled fish. We're not just drinking green smoothies all day. I mean, where are they doing that at? Okay. So here's the key to not going hungry. Snacks. Okay, I'm gonna show you some of the snacks we have. They have, uh, we have some that are high protein, but I'm gonna show you because one of the number one questions we get is, what snacks can I have on the green smoothie cleanse? Okay, so I'm gonna show you the snacks. Remember, you are drinking a green smoothie or you're eating a snack every few hours. So let me show you what we got. Okay, so one we have, can we see this okay? Okay, we have apples, and unsweetened peanut butter. And what people do, they get real fancy with it. They heat up their peanut butter and then they dip it in the apple. And ooh, child, this is really good like this, okay? You can always do nuts and seeds, uh, almonds I have here, I have some pecans, but in it, sunflower seeds, any nuts and seeds, don't limit yourself here. I'm just trying to show you an example. I don't want somebody to say, well, JJ said you can only have almonds and pecans. No, any nuts and seeds are perfectly fine as a snack, okay? And here's another one, right? Look at all this. You can have raw broccoli, you can have cucumbers, um, we got carrots, we got celery. A lot of people take their celery and they, you know, have it in like some kind of little homemade dip they made. You know, you can get real creative and fancy with it. And here's another one, I'm gonna show you this. If you add, let's say you were doing cucumbers as a snack. Cucumbers are perfectly fine. If you slice those up and put a little of this bad boy on there, and guess what? Add a little salt-free Mrs. Dash. Ooh, let me tell you, cucumbers and apple cider vinegar with a little bit of seasoning is to die for. You will start to learn more healthy snacks than you have ever learned because, you know, on the cleanse, you can't eat anything you want to eat. It is about simplicity. There is variety, but you can't have anything in your fridge. You just have to stay within the list of approved snacks. Now, in the book, in chapter four of the 10 day green smoothie cleanse, I go through all of this, I give you all the snacks. But the main thing I wanted you to know is you can eat on the cleanse, you're not drinking green smoothies all day, and you can have success. We've lost over a million pounds on the cleanse to date. And if you join our Facebook group, you can get a lot of support and encouragement. You can see before and after pictures, stay really inspired. That's where I hang out. So come check me out there. I'm JJ Smith and until next time, you know, make it a great day.